Rabbi Jeffrey Marker, and I'm a rabbi for human rights. And uh, because I could not be a rabbi for human rights, um, I know back when I was a, uh, before I was a rabbi, I um, heard uh, Abraham Joshua Heschel speak, and I read uh, his writings about the prophets, and it became clear to me that if I was not concerned with human rights and social justice, that it didn't make sense to be a religious Jew, that the two were tied together, um, that since if I didn't, if I wasn't for human rights and social justice, it didn't make sense to celebrate Shabbos, uh, that because Shabbos was supposed to be um, a foretaste of the world to come, it was supposed to be a taste of um, the just uh, society, so it felt like it was a lie to do that if I didn't try to change the world to make it a more just place. Uh, so that's how, I, that's how I came to be a, a rabbi for human rights. And um, I've, been, uh, I've been a rabbi for close to 30 years, and I've been involved with these kinds of struggles in the Jewish community and beyond for about 40 years. So, um, what are some of the struggles that you have been involved with? Um, involved with the struggle against the Vietnam War. I've been involved with uh, the with movement to create peace between the Israelis and Palestinians for um, since at least around 1969 or 70, about 40 years. 